All right, hello everybody, and welcome back to our QCAT tutorial. This video is going to be about uh, changing the color of your stroke lines as well as showing off aspect projections. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get started. So, we're going to add a new layer. We have our layer two here. Again, I made layer one because the recording kind of uh, wasn't exactly a uh, best quality because I used the bad color for the think uh, diagram. Uh, so, we have layer two here. We can change the color black. We have a whole bunch of colors here. We can just select any of them. You can go to a color ramp, check yellow, that's okay, click okay. Now once we go over to rectangles, we can just draw a rectangle here, and it'll show us a nice rectangle in yellow. So to do an extra projection, again we want to go back to here, click this button, click here. Uh, sorry, we're going to have to select it first. Do a symmetric projection. And we can change the various projections. So, for example, if we choose top, we have ourselves a top isometric projection that sort of, you can see it corresponds to this uh, section of the cube. We can do bottom, which again, it sort of uh, adjusts it a little bit. We have left, yeah, we have left facing, and of course, right facing, back facing. This is right facing, more or less. Uh, yeah, this is right facing, and then this is right back facing. So of course we could just draw something simple like this. Another like that. And this one's a little bit off, but you know it's gonna be uh, it's not gonna be perfect because again we're not drawing a cube. Uh, we're drawing some rectangles. And then, but yeah, so it's basically how you draw the isometric projections. I probably should have just used some squares or a square tool to draw it. But uh, if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I'll, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.